Good evening all, this is Ross Mitchell. I'm just doing a bit of an update. I have actually placed all the BMS boards onto each of the S22 bank that I have. And what ends up being they're mounted um, on the actual start of the battery with a nylock uh, spacer front and back. These boards are actually electrically isolated from the center pole. So the only electrical connection that these boards ha have are uh, the positive and negative terminals on the actual battery. I've made up all the transmit receive cables between the boards, which is only made up of pre-made cables, and I've cut cut them, uh, the two halves, and soldered them together so they're at the right length. Uh, if you have a look at that, that is actually the connector uh, spade terminals that I've used on the actual BMS boards, I've um, laid them out a little bit and drilled a little tiny hole in them out to 3mm so I can actually put a nut and uh, on each side uh, that way it, it makes it nice and neat as you can see uh, I'm quite happy with that with the spade terminals the way they've laid out it'll actually be a female terminal that actually sits on those ones so being a female terminal with them shrink wrap around them, they'll actually be uh, insulated if I actually got to disconnect the board and don't have to worry about much about the tail end touching all the buzz bar around there. What I've done also, when I built the BMS in the first place, uh, are the actual um, buzz bars. If you see the back, there's two 4 mil holes and also I think it's an 8 mil hole. Those 4 mil holes are actually drilled and tapped. Same as the front ones, they're actually drilled and tapped so that I'll be able to put four mil lugs on each one of those for each individual BMS board so that makes it nice and neat I was fortunate that I did that in the early stage you cannot have too many nuts and bolts and and fittings to go on your buzz bar um, so that's basically the layout as so far so next few days I will um, I'll get it all electrically connected up and it should be uh, running with a bit of uh, tweaking and uh, fault finding hopefully. So that's where I'm up to. Yeah, thank you.